Yo, what's up? It's your boy Chasing Head with a brand new episode of Heart and Soul Sneaker Vlog. As you can see, I'm not in my regular spot. I'm outside Blue Tile down here at Five Points. I'm going to show you guys where the spots where I cop some of my kicks out here in Columbia. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get in. Valentine's joint, so this is a six and a half. That's why we still have 
<laughs> you know, but one thing different, they tighten the trail up on the dump. So if you look at the dump in there, there's one that's like wider circles. Yeah. They're tight, they're like tighter circles, so it gives you more room to work on for it as well. Yeah. That's so really good. Also, this is a section five on the midsole. There we go. Oh, that's the key cascading Oh, okay. So it's going to be lighter. Yeah. So they like show that that final thing. And then the other cool thing is, like you can say now, the zoom air and the pour on the forefoot. Okay. So there's a whole lot more. Not to mention they have to use premium materials to put up a skateboard. Yeah, definitely. And then they have this whole toe box is sewn, folded in, and sewn again so that the seams don't pull apart. Yeah. They're skating with you, which is going to make the shoe last longer. And you know, increase mass and everything. So we're going for an eight. Heel, heel <laughs> it's a lot better shoe. So. Yeah, definitely. Um, I started wearing SBs um, probably like a couple years ago, and like as soon as I, I first put it on, I could definitely tell the difference, especially with the comfort, because they put a little bit more padding in them and everything. It's just this is overall it's a more comfortable shoe. Even with the Janowski that you got on, it's just the just that. Um, Zoom air heel. Yeah. So much. Yeah. It's actually probably one of the most comfortable shoes that I have. I actually got these from you guys too. <laughs> yeah. They were at the last size, so I had to compromise a little bit. I usually wear a nine and a half, either eight and a half. So. Yeah. <laughs> My foot's hurting a little bit, but it's still, it's still comfortable. Yeah. It's still more comfortable than this. Oh, you know, still speaking. Super excited about those because I had the shoes from photos of myself as a kid wearing the Jordans. And yeah. And, uh, so it's like pretty cool. Like back before there was a lot of skate shoe brands. That's what everybody was riding. They were easy. Honestly, they went on sale a lot. So you could yeah. pair for like 40 bucks and uh, they look great. Yeah. So I was really excited for them. And there's a new one. There's another one we should have. Yeah, I was just going to ask you about that. I wasn't a big fan of the first colorway, the black and green, but um, I was looking at the new, the new colorway. I was really feeling out. Did you, did you get a pair? I got a pair. Oh, okay. But yeah, I was going to ask you about the first one. Did you get it? Yeah. Um, vegan. Oh, um, if I'm buying shoes for myself. Yeah. He's collaborated yeah. with Jordan or whatever, or making an Air Jordan set. So, so no, it's kind of like the scenario if they don't sell by some crazy miracle, they get a pair. That's what it's there. First yeah. one, big. She already knows. You know, it's a bit of a conspiracy because they say the people that work at the sneaker store, they'll hold you know, exclusive shoes for their friends and things like that. So, how do you guys handle like, you know, major releases? We don't hold anything for anybody. Um, Charles, who works here, is our biggest sneaker head. You know, but he usually gets his pair, but at the same time, he's on the very something sneaker groups. He's banging shoes for us. He's an asshole for us. He can't buy a shoe to even. If he's like freaking out about stuff that's coming out in two months, he's so mean. He'd just be like, nope, we're going to sell him now. Yeah, he definitely needs his first dibs on the bottom. Usually, you get like 112, 113 a lot of times. So, like, do you but no discounts on it. It's full, full price, like whatever it is. I think that's good. I think that's good. Um, do you guys like tickets? Like, I know some other sneakers, so they just like wrap up tickets and things like that. We usually have the 
combine and just like a few people at a time. Okay. What's the craziest for you? For the Tiffany's being out for a couple days. Wow. Three days. Wow. Crazy. It's crazy. I can't tell twice. And it was only for a few hours. But yeah, probably like, I think it was probably like six hours at the most. Yeah. Yeah, they were camped out for days. <laughs> the one there was a cool story that there was one guy who camped from Thursday. He slept there Friday night. He was drinking. <laughs> so he got home, passed out, and slept yeah. through the release. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. He didn't get the shoes, and then another guy that paid a homeless person to stand in line with him so he could get two pairs. Wow. I guess that's legit. I mean, yeah. he's been waiting there. <laughs> he's been camping with him. So yeah. Wow. Well well. so, uh, uh, okay. uh, um, so I see you got a couple stuff you want to show up. Yeah, we get a lot of times. There's like different tier accounts, especially for Nike. We're going to tier zero account, and it goes tier one, tier two, tier two. Oh, so tier zero, you get the most exclusive. Yeah. Wow. Tier one. Oh, yeah, they, they'll get some, some, some kind of weird stuff. So, uh, I'll go to a tier zero account. Even with the uh, brands like Puff, this is a Easter pack of socks. Okay. It's super simple. I mean, it's just socks. But yeah. yeah, yeah. Here, they only offer these to their top 20 accounts. Uh, uh, top 20 accounts in the country. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we're well, well, in South Carolina gets in there because we move a lot of stuff. I see like the those guys are specialists. You know, there's a there's a handful of shops in the country that are going to be able to call. Yeah, yeah. Those are the shops that are going to on that, that little plateau. Because we've all been skating for 30 years. Yeah. Oh, my God. I've skated for 30 years. <laughs> and then this, uh, we've got a couple of cool releases. And again, this is like a super exclusive set. Oh. That they were shipping on the store the next day. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah. Very rare. Wow. We have a super limited amount of these. I'm trying to scramble to find more anywhere. <laughs> That's I'm probably not going to happen. So, yeah, those are cool. That's to celebrate 420. We have those. Um, and then this is the following weekend, the 26th. <laughs> Just came in, we just came in today, that's why I was like, oh, yeah, they <laughs> cannot sell these until the 26th. Uh, so, like, there's also a high top top of this. Well, and then we've got some other um, brand Lakai. Yeah, I have a little bit, yeah. We've got an Earl sweatshirt collaboration. Oh,
they started here and moved to Los Angeles. Oh, wow. Yeah. Uh, not, not very many people know that American Apparel started like, right down the street. Yeah, I didn't yeah. know that. <laughs> Shop right. Yeah. So, appreciate Tough in Columbia. No, tough okay, the South. So. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say another thing that um that I learned like just from talking to you is uh you know just staying staying uh, consistent. Because right. you know you said you know you gotta start it small and right? you know you get some of the most exclusive stuff from from right. some of the biggest companies. Yeah. So, you know, that's definitely something that you know I'm I'm definitely take take what's take what you need. Yeah. I would say this too, like a lot of my parents are like, Yeah, I'm gonna open a skate shop and they open a skate shop and that's it. The imagination stops there. Yeah. You know, it's just like Trying to make it happen in Columbia. 
So I appreciate you guys for watching. We got another episode of Heart and Soul. Thank you for following me on Twitter at night. You follow me on Twitter at Heart and Soul Kicks. Kicks with a Z. Follow me on Instagram at J underscore FM underscore S. And I appreciate you guys liking, watching, and uh, tune in later.